Hi, good day. This is a no intro video. We are going directly to what you are here for. So today we are going to find the derivative of any function using the definition of limits. So the definition of limits says that in finding the derivative of any function so equals to the limit of f quantity x plus h minus f of x all over h as h approaches zero. Okay, so basically this is the definition of limits and we are going to use this one in solving functions or in finding the derivative of any functions. So we have an example here. Let's get right to the example. Example number one, uh, f of x equals to 2x. So we are going to solve this one using this definition of limits. So the definition of limits says that simply we replace the x variable with the x plus h as what the definition says. We replace the x variable with x plus h. So let us try to do that one. Okay, we just copy the 2, copy the 2, then replace the x variable with x plus h. Then subtracted with the original function which is 2x. The f of x is equal to 2x, that's why we put the 2x here. All over h, just copy the h here as h approaches 0. Again, we have, uh, we are, I'm going to repeat the, the process. Just copy the numerical value here, then replace the, replace the variable with x plus h. So, for instance, there are more than one x variable in the function. For example, 2x squared plus x, so there are more than one. So, uh, each, no, each, each x variables, you are going to replace it with x plus h. Again, each x variables you are going to replace it with x plus h. So it means the, the more x variable, the longer your uh, solution will be. Okay, so we replace the x with x plus h minus the function itself, f of x minus the function itself. The function itself is 2x. So we just copy the 2x all over h. We just copy the h from here. Then as h approaches 0, we just simply copy this part from this one. Copy this part from this one, then replace the x variable with this one, copy the uh, function itself, 2x, copy the h. Okay, then simplify. We are going to simplify this one. 2 times x is 2x, 2 times h is 2h, then copy this one, the function, the value of the function, minus 2x all over h, just copy the h, as h approaches 0. We can simplify this one. If you notice, we have positive 2x and negative 2x. So we can cancel out this one. So what's left is uh, positive 2h all over h. So we have here positive 2h all over h. Then we can further simplify this one. We have, you can cancel out the h variable. We have h. Uh, so basically, it is equal to positive 2. We can say that the, the derivative of the function 2x is equal to positive 2. Okay, the derivative of the uh, function 2x using the definition of limit is positive 2. Alright, so is it clear? Thank you for watching and I hope you have learned something. Bye-bye.